Welcome back. PVC rod holder for bank fishing. This time it's holding two rods. Let's go in the shop, show you how I made it. For the first piece, we're using three quarter inch PVC schedule 40. This is what we're gonna cut the initial base out of. Okay, let's get ready to measure out and cut the base. Measure 16 inches. Mark that. We're gonna cut this at an angle. Make a spike in the ground. So we got our angle cut on one side. The other side's nice and square. So when you get these T's, this isn't centered side to side. There's three quarters of an inch difference. So to make up for that, I've got this piece at two and a quarter, this piece at three inch. When we put everything together, this will be centered up. I'll do a quick dry fit and I'll show you what I'm talking about. This is going to be your center post. Two and a quarter. Three inch. There. Now when you look at that, this is sitting in dead center between them. So you see these black lines right here. What I did, went out and set it up in the yard, grabbed a couple poles, set them down in here, and started changing the angles until I got to where I wanted until they were both even. Once it was there, quick sharpie line across all three. Now I can take this apart, put it back together, everything's always going to line up, angles will be right, no guesswork. Here's our three quarter inch spike on the bottom. fit that on. That's got the threads. That's going to fit into this. And from there, that's going to sit on here. We've got these three inch long 1024 machine screws, lock nuts and washers. And that's how we're going to pin everything together. I'm going to drill them out. Fits. Bolt through there, a couple washers, lock nut, real steady. Let's do the rest of them. So the bolts are in it. Put them together real quick. Here you can see where I drew these marks. I'm going to cut those out. That way when the rod sets down in there, it doesn't spin on you. With the spinning rod, the reel will catch. And with the casting rod, the thumb guard will catch. So with this rod holder, you don't have to trust the PVC. Take this hunk of rebar, put it down in the ground, that's good and solid. Take our rod holder, set it down in.
It's like that video of the double rod holder, but you only want a single. I made one of them too. Check out my other videos, step by step on how to make this one. Thanks.